Please rise for a moment of silence to be followed by the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, BHS. I'm Emily. And I'm Addie. And, and welcome, welcome to Bash TV. TV. Today is Monday, October 10th, making today the official 20 to 23rd day of school and day one of the cycle. Pinko shirt sale ends tomorrow. All student council members must have their orders and money due but to Mrs. Curry tomorrow by 3 o'clock p.m. The guidance office will hold a finan financial aid information night on Wednesday, October 12th, beginning 6.30 p.m. in the auditorium. The financial aid process will be discussed, including how to get your FSA ID income information required to complete the FAFSA. FAFSA, and more. All college-bound seniors and their parents are encouraged to attend. Buck Bucknell University will be hosting a college fair tonight from 6.30 to 8 p.m. at the Gerard Field House. Over 60 colleges will be represented. College-bound students and their families are encouraged to attend. Tickets to the homecoming dance on Saturday, October 29th are on sale now in the guidance office. Tickets are $10 each in advance and $15 at the door. Admission for homecoming ceremony is separate, $2 at the door before the ceremony, which begins at 7 p.m. in the auditorium. Students who wish to bring a guest from another school district to the dance must complete a guest pass form available in the guidance office. Guest pass forms must have a photo ID attached and must be submitted to Mr. Bennett in the office no later than Wednesday, October 26th. If you are interested in joining any branch of the military, the first step would be to sign up for the ASVAB on November 2nd at the BHS. Sign up today in the guidance office. Any student interested in going to Costa Rica this June with Mrs. Rothery should plan to attend an informational meeting on Tuesday, October 11th at 6 p.m. in room 29. Please enter through the double doors by the library for more information. Stop by room 29 to pick up a packet with trip details. If you are already signed up for the trip, you do not need to attend this meeting. The next SAD meeting will be held on October 13th at 7.30 a.m. or 2.40 p.m. in the library. Please plan to attend one of the meetings. SAD will collect items for Beyond Violence in the library through the end of October. Please stop by to see what all is needed. All contributions are greatly appreciated. Well, that's it for Main Desk. Now I'll send it over to FYI with Joseph. Thanks, Addison and Emily. Welcome to FYI, where we explore what's happening around school. I'm Joseph. Mondays from 3.30 to 5.30 p.m., math, tutoring, and homework assistance from a teacher, retired math teacher support is provided in all levels up to pre-calculus. Tutoring can also be scheduled outside of the day time listed. Please email the teen center to schedule or for any questions. The following are some volunteer opportunities available to stu students. Please remember all students will need to complete 30 hours of volunteer slash community service for your graduation project. On October 14th and 15th, Camp Luis is also looking for volunteers to help with their haunted trail, Terror on the Mountain. They specifically need creepy lurkers, improv skits, and presentations, trail guides. Wear your scariest costumes or just dress as you usually do. Beginning Thursday, October 13th, 5.30 to 6.30 p.m. at 212th West 11th Street, Beyond Violence is hosting a group for you, a place to go where you feel heard and discuss topics that matter to you. There are flyers located in Guidance, the Library, the Nurse's Office, and the Bulletin Board by the Music Wing. Scan the QR code for more info and the link to register. And finally, on October 24th from 5.30 to 7.30 p.m., the McBride Library is looking for storytellers to help with their not-so-scary story walk. Essentially, you will need read a two- to three-minute Halloween story to a group of trick-or-treating little kids. Wear a not-so-scary costume, bring a flashlight, and get ready to have a great evening. Cider and donuts will be served in the garden at the end of the walk. Remember, these are all opportunities to accumulate your community service hours. Well, that's it for FYI. Let's send it over to Sports with Sean. Thanks, Joseph. I'm Sean. Any student who plans to play baseball in the spring should stop in the guidance office for a practice schedule. 
Any student interested in wrestling this year should report to the CAF today at 2.10 for a brief meeting. Last Thursday in sports, the girls' volleyball team defeated the Wilkes-Barre Wolfpack three sets to none. Camille Pintrich had 15 service points and three aces. CeCe Eisenberg finished with 17 kills, and Sarah Stieber added nine kills. Now let's take a look at tonight's sporting events. JV football is away with Dallas at 6 p.m. Boys varsity soccer is away with Nanticoke at 4.15 p.m. with a dismissal time of 2.15 p.m. Girls varsity soccer is home with Dallas at 6.30 p.m. Varsity field hockey is home with Wallen Paul Pack at 4.15 p.m. Happy birthday today to James Bauer. Have a great day, BHS.